I'm gonna ship up the vento. It's just a vibe. Vibe. My content legendary. This is Kwai Perry with all the vibe. Vibe. You know I'm doing it right. Watch any vid that you like for all the vibe. Yeah, yeah, vibes. Click that bell anytime and you will get notified with all the vibe. Yeah, yeah, vibes. So go comment and like and don't forget to subscribe for Strictly Vibes Hi guys, welcome back to another video Now in this week's video, this is the part 2 to what is the worst thing a woman has ever done to you Now this is on a male perspective But before we get into this week's video, ensure to check out the links in my description box Of course, this week's upcoming YouTube And of course, check out the videos on my vlog channel There's a new video over there, please go and watch it, subscribe and comment So yes, we have a guest to the channel <laughs> Stranger at all. So um, I don't know all the team already at this point. You guys are so in love with these Q and I don't know I, what is going I on. I don't know. It's a storytelling or something about it. Yeah, man. Know. The reaction too. I feel like YouTube has just taken like a whole shit. You guys prefer a lot of sit down. So the challenge them and them look at something to get pack. Yeah. Oh, pack out. Pack out. So we're gonna respond to some of your stories. So um, let's get into it. No, man get into it um the person's name is Bob Bob said somebody done with this girl for a two year and a half right call her talk she always did things say me did that cheap but bear in mind me never yet cheap on her cause me did love her bad bad ready for all wife or two but clearly she never loved me cause she gave me born no more time than me could have come but again me did love her and being an idiot that I was but if me decide to stay with her. Anyways, one day me did not carry my stepsister back from work and she did ask her to stop over this Chinese restaurant because she did other food and it did ready for pick up. When we walk in with her now, Mr. Tug's best friend call her Kim. Sit down on one of the table them I stay for me. So being the friendly person that I am, I called to her and wave. I don't know if she didn't think so, I did them with my step stepsister or something But Kim get up, look at me, roll her eyes and walk back Walk out on her phone like say she call somebody Okay then Never think nothing of it cause me and Kim don't really agree <coughs> When we done drop off my stepsister and reach home now For the surprise talks and some Chinese food now Wait, when you surprise her, she added food? No, stepsister added the food Oh yeah, so because I'm going with the steps sister and my carry little food go get to Hello. keep up rolling. Apparently she did already set up the house really really nice with some rose petal and candle and one bag of other something. Come out with food so she had made dinner for the two away. So when we sit down now I already forgot eat, she share out the two away food and put them on the table. But then she says something about she gone for the pepper sauce in the kitchen and she gone. She soon come back. Me is a man I love pepper you know. Some say alright I'll make sure tell her if you bring enough to. When she come back now, she come back with two small bowl of pepper sauce. Why when we're ready to take it from her and pour it in my plate. She got stop and said, no babe, this one is for me because it's not so spicy like the other one. So use this one instead. You don't find that suspicious. You don't find that suspicious. I'm going to pour the whole light in my plate. You see next morning when we're ready to go work, all this will wash me. I'm just a shiver and a vomit, so could I even get out of bed the way I'm sick? He had to admit it. But my ass shit up the bed too. So I call my brother and tell him to come care of me at hospitals because I literally feel like I'm going to dead. End up there in the hospital for about three weeks. I wasn't ready to leave now. One of the doctors then carry me in a him office, sit me down, and I tell me about how lucky my how lucky my brother. She gave her advice, huh? Did reach in with me so early, cause if I didn't wait any longer, they know that dead. Then he go ask me one bag of question about who I live with and where my diet consists of and one bag of other thing. After all, that now him really gonna tell me say it look like somebody that tried pisin me the night before I come in. You can't believe say the girl go pisin me. None more than our best friend did call her and tell her say me out with girl I buy dinner at a Chinese restaurant. 
after I come out of the hospital, I already forgot to report her to the station. It's like she and her best friend disappear off of the planet because we never see them again. So, me ask you something there now. Them, some me are real. Me not ask you if I want to show where what. A red pie she put in the food? Me not understand. Something that makes sense to me because all, you're there with the woman for how long now? Two years. You're there with Tugs. So, Tugs, I know your stepsister. I don't me I say, we don't know discuss. Like family, like one of them. Over so I don't know what real something we do in a day. I want to I want to play play something. I want to run up and down type of thing like I look a play girl something. You take it for Dolly House because all you know is Phoebe stepsister. Why not like stepsister? Like never seen a picture, never asked. Don't want to know his last name or anything. And this is something that says because why are there with somebody where I give you so much bond and you're there with her steering me for love. And then my thing is, I'm about she... a big question mark too because why you and the best friend agree if the girl had one like give you a bond? That's true, but then remember says he was saying she always thought he was giving her a bond. So really and truly, she had give back bond because she thinks she had get bond, not necessarily because she had give bond out of her own accord. On the civic, you understand what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> we don't have about women are national because I'm one for born. We don't know one relationship. We don't know we don't know Easter. We have played last week. We don't know one Easter weekend. But now look how the lady nearly kill you. You know we talked for two years and you know we still in our hotel lock and she had a born. So all you proved to her say you're not a born born. Why you still? And I'm sure he didn't prove because as I said, he said she already thought or she thinks he's giving her a born. So clearly not doing something right. And, and I then we go um a situation here because I'm a born with woman to Chinese restaurants. And you tell me say you the woman don't pick up with stepsister Tanania. Let me say something to you. Me and you they wrong. I want to say Tanania here one now. You know say I'm good enough stepsister though. Exactly. Yeah, because me and you are the Rowan. I'm no say Kim see me at a restaurant. I'm no say Kim and call you. I'm gonna take up the phone and call you. See every time I say you know say me see Kim. I'm no Kim I'm gonna tell you there with that woman, but me just want you to know say I'm a step sister. You're not getting the girl on real teams. You can't trick me, you take me a fool. I know what you're there with man. You don't have no respect neither. You, you, you guys usually get the girl, but it's not just step sister, you lie. You're too wicked because you know. Because you know say you ain't no green. And you saw Kim. And you know what say the girl thinks it's a bunny again. But maybe, maybe at this point, the man exhausted and then they can't work. But you didn't in love. Know what you say? What kind of love that you're exhausted, Ron? I love that. That is not love. I love it. That's the man will buy a man. This is so much you keep with the stew pot. I don't want that. After my after my after my put on my lingerie and come out with my roast fitter and my things them and I cook your food and stuff. And I'm ready for poison, y'all. Oh. I sight sing all yours. I don't even forget because you're going to the Chinese restaurant and feel like say Kim never go see a Kim never. I you know that me and say my boss, you not have it. You not have it. But now I buy the get some pretty pies in it. Bob shit up the bed in the bed. Bob shit up the place in the bed. Bob do it on the bed. I'm taking any mile. And you're not even FBI could I get told some of them stories. Oh, that's God, no. My name is Senna Badi Days. Mom, I know a permit shit on me. Mom, you're wicked because you knew that King was going to call her. You never Mom, you're said, running. Mama called Tugs before. You're not real Tugs. You're not Tugs and Ritz. You're not real Shri. And I just said she would read somebody else. This is a Tinder story. Was on Tinder minding my own business. Yeah, Aunt Katty jumping on my DM. I tell my all my nice and all these things and if I would I like to have drinks. But my cars my tick with my pants and at my head right away I say yes. She send me the location and all these things so we link up and have a drink. Everything going smoothly with drinking and chatting and vibes. I keep seeing you with the eyes mama from reach. But I just say in my mind I must show she look good. Long story short, did I know some mama search our man phone? And she said, I'm over there at the same place to the next cafe. And met me and her link up at the same place. Only see the man come step across and grab up mama, you know. Who get powered now? I just cut and block her from Tinder. <laughs> you know, so I play some dangerous game, though. Jonathan, I like that you're honest, though, and you say you take it with your pants and not with your head. Because as a man, I know so I feel like I'm going to be bigger than the tough and I can't take on anything. But you don't know the woman from nowhere, and you got to have drinks with the lady. Not just only so. that, not, not, not only that, never talk to nobody. I say you will want drinks. That thing that's something, yeah. And you, as a woman, I treat you have intentions, you know, but that was so careless. You just meet the man on Tinder and send him your location. Yeah. Look how you really make the man kitchen and want to something with the, with, the, with, the, with, the, with, the, with the official man. She knows sir, her man is not a lick man, her man of woman strength. The man never got a lick no man, the woman is not a lick. Her woman strength, the man, I'm not for the man of woman strength. So she didn't know. So she now called Jonathan and Jonathan and they come and he was just so upset the man. He never got a lick Jonathan. Jonathan don't get for run, man. She not a fool. Them something like a real life, some of them you're like. So you know, see the people that are sending them something? Yeah, but like me, I ask you, like me, 
I don't to get up and just say, oh, I know I said X, I got X, so I'm going to bring Y for make X jealous. Like, I just don't know how to think of them something here. And when you reach to Tinder, like, you never have no little, little, little man She don't have all the Tinder, she don't have that long time. Long time. <laughs> she don't have that profile long time. <laughs> she don't she not have trick nobody this so. <laughs> I regular she screw this and I regular she this. Hello. I regular hello. she swipe to the left and swipe to the right. Right, and then I go invite her the boy for drinks. A long time she said that boy there. And I say, you know, I like the boy, I'm gonna invite him out. When I got talked to him, she showed that they were there for two years, like um, Bob and the other girl. And then they might pass them when they were yeah, dead. Yeah, man. Yeah. I think the location is something kind of scary. Yes. Well, you know, I really know nobody still, but at least give it a little bit more time. Oh, man, I can't make my bad out of the door. Someone look here. That's the next thing I'm gonna do. No, I can't make my bad out of the door. What a man give me a dick. No, pure migraine being out of the door, because what is this? Oh, what a man make me feel a way I'm a summer. You got your phone and sister, my location, and sister, man. I go drink some girl, you you're gone up there. Nah, drink some water, everything. As a cute, cute girl. So you go shit the man for it. And the man for the shit, the man come drink you off. Don't say about the two shelly on. I'm not going back a man too much. Nah, do we? I'm not going to Olympics. Met the boy one. I'm not going to see that man and just go on the self and understand the self and go on around one part, around one place. When no me and a girl can't walk in at the same show. I get to know on the self. Our foot big. I rest on the body. I eat my way around. I rest on the front. She wear 12. Me and her is not the same. I want a big foot babbit. I was in a relationship with a girl from school days. She left Jamaica and went to live in England. I also left Jamaica and went to live in another caribbean island we continue the relationship long distance she would come to visit me every chance she gets off work fast forward to one of the times she came to visit me and the whole time while she was here she kept crying that if this is going to work long distance we should get married and how much she really loved me and i don't love her because i don't want to get married to her the day she was leaving for England, I lose. I used my last money to buy her a ring and propose to her. Can you read the rest? Can you read the rest? From what you ring, does I make you laugh? Can you read the rest? Only to find out that she got pregnant less than a year later. Hold on. She cried and begged and apologized she said that it was a one night she said it was a one night stand and how much she is sorry and she still wants to get married to me my family loved her she could do no wrong for them myself loved her too so i forgave her and got married to her and now telling them no lie I said the flag could have really? red little more. Really? The, flag, the flag could have the flag. Una, go see him we a full speed at him. Oh no no, oh no no, oh no no, oh no no, if you finish up. Because you don't want L-O-V-E out. Can't work with no God no. One year and some months after our wedding, she came back to visit me. Oh. Well, like one year and some months after the wedding, so where should the salon at? You know, the Caribbean. She should they have been glad. She say she should have been glad. Yeah, she should have been glad. Anyways, she came back to visit me. We spent six weeks together. The whole time she was here, she dwelled on how much she loved me. No other man can see her panty. And how she was waiting until I come to England for us to... Yes, sister, I am live in England. Why me I follow? I she live in England. Stop, stop, stop. Oh, okay, yes. Yeah. No, something to do today, no. Something to do today. Anyways, yeah, man. Just waiting until I came to England for us to live our life. Cry every second how much she loves me. And after one week of her returning to the UK, she sent me a positive pregnancy test. The minute she sent me the test, it felt like a cloud came over me. I didn't want anything to do with her. It's safe to say I instantly hated her. She breathed again. <laughs> she breathed again. She leave him. I hated her more. <laughs> She first time, man. Every time she called, I hated her more. Every time she called, I hated her more. <laughs> she came to visit me again when she was six months pregnant. I couldn't stand to look at her. You may be wondering why I allow her to visit if I hated her that much. It was from my parents. They begged me not to turn my back on her and the child, Wait, but the no two. matter, yeah, man. But no matter how hard I fought, my feeling it got worse. Something in my gut wouldn't let me love that child. Channel. The children. 
Kind of the second one, Lisa. I should do that. Should the first one. Should the first one, the first one being service. <laughs> service. After the child was born, my family worshipped him as if he was the first boy grandchild for them. My parents curse me every day. The wicked girl cups me and call my parents every chance. Cups me and call my parents every chance she got. My life was a living nightmare. When the child was two, she brought the child to visit me and I hide and did a paternity test only to find out that the baby wasn't my child. I thought he needed a paternity. So are we alone to know? I think are we alone to know that they never know. No, i alone never know because she didn't know. And the parents so didn't so know. So me, she, and you didn't know. Oh, but even, I'm alone. Even the dark. Dark. No man in water ball, but can I say? The whole time the wicked girl and her neighbor in England was in a relationship. Oh, that's why she breathed so easy. Oh, the penis was in close proximity. She <gasps> wicked though. The only, the only person I feel sorry for in this relationship it's is the child. first child. <laughs> the one that went to <laughs> the <savior. laughs> and, then, and the current one. We feel bad. <laughs> because she invited a child that she never ready for bring forth into the world. And she born the man and she know she was running. I said she had cried for Jamaica, so. And my thing is, you wicked idiot. Terrible. It's a big stone if you get nine feet. And you know, I bring the man and you use the man's parents against him because every time you have the man because they call the parents. And you, you, know, know, so them, them, you know them well one grandchildren. And yeah, you know them, you know the boy parents. I'm going to put him in a shape and family. Um, and, and sit back things you don't know. But you know the man hates you oh, because no, every time you call him, he hates you more. <laughs> I mean, you want a girl in our relationship because we can't see this clear. I yeah, yeah. uh, uh, And she come back with belly. One year and six months. Do the maths and tell me when you would have breed in the one year I'm and six months. I'm too finished. I could have nearly have another one year and six months. I'm going to take care of a child. Not nearly. I mean, nearly. Yeah, I'm, I'm too pretty. And at least we tell them about the red flag them. Because if she did it one time, she have the propensity to do it again! Because clearly, if you are not there with her, are I wondering? She have her wondering, I am she fertile! I she have a strained cat! <laughs> I kept the walk up and down, man! I kept them busy gun up and never yard gun lock! T-Fort! A T-Fort things out of the mail! We pass out again! No, man! She have a strained cat! <laughs> I'm supposed to walk up and down England, God no. <laughs> England, no, no, it's next door. No, 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 but I'm supposed to walk up and down England. Oh my God, I wonder if it's a church goer. You make him like him, him very sheltered, like you know, really. She have, she have, she have to be careful though, because she really needs to stop ruffling her belly. She have to be careful. She's she fertile, man, Perry, but how come him never yet connect nothing with this, sir? I don't know, he's not having no, no, oh, no, a cable. He's screwing up in the world. He's screwing up in the world, and he wants an adapter. Oh. He wants an adapter, my God. They pretend she called me. I hate it anymore. And you build up so much resentment for the girl, but see how your parents are. Some of the parents don't know who I am. And I love the woman them too much. The and sacrifice on the man and on the pity of their mental health. Terrible. For the sake of love and marriage, because only no one get divorced. And the parents and bullies still, they're miserable. You can give me a church cup, a church family. I'm you telling you, that's what it's giving me. Yeah, shelter. And the parents don't believe in a divorce. And they never really date nobody before, so they know when woman be wicked. Because yeah. one year and three months, I don't see this girl. And, and I don't marry say, her. And you don't see them family. Pure video card. You don't see the, the, the father pull one past. Pure FaceTime. Mr. M, I'm so sorry, okay? And I shouldn't have to do that to you. I'm not outside of that. Hurt people, hurt people. Mr. M is gonna hurt so many people now. Yeah, man, cause the trauma in my walking right there, so. Every time she. You this is my entry. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Just read the something or something. Now. Best late entry of the century. I it, <laughs> Anyways, I'm 33 years old. My ex and I were together for almost 10 years. The most toxic, turmoil relationship. Why? Yeah, man. We did argue too much, but nothing, about nothing most time. She left me October gone and we did fine, I would say. Majority of the relationship, she was seeing other people right throughout. Other people? Yeah, man. How I find out, one of her brother, friend them, that's a mutual friend of mine, tell me everything in witness. Okay. How whenever she and her friend them, would have the road, she always have a different nigga around, a different nigga around her. Even her ex before me. She was having sex with all of them. 
My friend them used to send me an idiot because she would have got out and come in all hours at night. I'm in a questioner. My boss is angry at <laughs> All next morning she come home, Mama always says she and her friend them are doing them thing now. Watch now, woman, I start them. One of the niggas them she did a bond me with is a producer for a big artist too. Luckily, we find out when she left me and move on because apparently we did too boring, demanding, and argumentative. I would take accountability that I'm a typical yard man who believes in gender roles. I have the house, she take care of it, and me, that's all I ask for. She never wanted to stop working, so she do all that plus work. We used to argue about that too, her not wanting to, her not wanting to be a stay-at-home GF. Oh, and we also had a miscarriage in 2020 during COVID. Which was also a turning point for the relationship. More while when my priest said she did I do all this cheating and sleeping around while me and her sleeping around with me and doing things with me to me, my heart get cold up. Imagine when she was 17, her mom had put her out and she stayed with someone she thought she could trust, and the youth end up rape her. I didn't know some of feel like we just start feel heavy. Yeah, you know, say from the start, I got up in me, I say, you know, say, but you just know, start, say something, come here, say something about a girl, yeah. We just start feel heavy when we start, then it start go down in the miscarriage and yeah, man. the gender roles. Come here, say, I'm holding for so heavy. Yeah, man, yeah, man. Really oh my something. god, end up rape her. Me being as a friend at the time, tell her she could stay with me and from there we relationship blossomed no. until she was 26. No. When she left me, we're there. I'm in a party and go out. We try to be romantic but me and get for find out that she didn't want more and I wasn't enough. Never yet cheat on her. Closest me ever come to is a little work wife when we did have where would I cook and me taste it once in a blue moon. Oh my god, that's so funny. A big woman who could have be a mother to to be honest, that's all. But boy, me know she come from a very broken home and things so maybe this are just she but I'm afraid a woman y'all yeah, love them but me I did me a, my thing different now. Respect my G. I think the fact that you said after her unfortunate incident that happened when she was 17 mm -hmm. you were her friend and you you know took her in mm -hmm. i don't think at that time would have been a good time for you guys to enter into a relationship, relationship because right. that is a very very traumatic experience and mm -hmm. a lot of persons whilst they will live they never truly get over something like that and mm -hmm. to be in a relationship with somebody who you seem to, even though you're like a yard man or whatever, you seem to have a lot of boundaries and a lot of, you know, certain things where you have to respect. Mm -hmm. I don't think a relationship, especially one that is so structured, would have been the right thing for her at that time. Right. So I'm not going to tell you that, oh, you should have used or used this experience to mark every woman that come. Because I know so every woman stay. Right. But everybody have a little story. Everybody have a reason as to why they behave the way they behave. And this unfortunately it's just her reason and you just got caught up in it you know what wanting to love her and that's fine because you should want to love her mm -hmm. but you know them have that saying they will say if you love a flower don't pick it you just water it and make it grow mm -hmm. yeah my boss at that at that kind of reach you understand and the thing she was yours and was to be yours only because you invested so much into her especially from such an early age especially from such an early age and it's unfortunate it will work out for some persons it mm -hmm. could not and did not work out for you because again her story is different and she has probably not yet healed i was about to say that something happening to you at such like a young age mm -hmm. yes it's traumatic but like a lot of people respond to it differently right. it can go like one of many ways it's either you become very recluse sheltered to yourself you, just... you don't want to engage in any relationship with any man or you would more opt to engage in a relationship with a woman because it's more tender it's more you know more soft mm -hmm. or the opposite spectrum to that is you come a little Wild bit out. you know promiscuous you know and that is in an effort to understand yourself or reclaim yes you know say, i'm choosing this i'm ch i'm choosing yes my partners because yes. i didn't have that chance that chance was taken from me yes. once um 
And also, you yeah, try to get for no one understand yourself and what understand you like, your body what you because don't like. that's such a like that's such a um violating experience, you know, having that like taken from you. So I guess some of the decisions that was made in that relationship was as a result of that. Mm -hmm. Um, and yes, at the time you were a safe space for her, but as Tanani said, I don't think that you guys should have entered into a mm -hmm. relationship. Not something because so structured, you know, she work and she not fit do this and mm. she be a stay at home and get right. it and her also going out with her friends might be a safe space for her that's true you know like her friends might because you know because maybe she's still in her mind maybe that's something that she thinks about mm -hmm. so her girlfriends are her haven like them take her mind off of even thinking about that true, true. and in the midst of that she now has this agency to choose um a man you know, out there where she would like to engage in sexual relationships, but at least this point, this time, she have a choice. But that's right. I, I, I've never been in a situation like that, so I can't tell somebody how to respond. It's just unfortunate, and um, and I think that's also one of the reasons why you guys resulted in so much arguments for mm. simple things. Yeah, for like simple things. It's just built up because I'm learning that in relationships. I don't know some arguments are just not worth it because bigger arguments and more meaningful arguments right. are eventually gonna come so you have to choose your battles in relationships and I'm learning that sort of like small argue, some sometimes a small argument doesn't make a sense Why so when it, yes, so. yeah man so when the big argument come now you're bringing all that resentment you had from that's why you left the plate there yes, so into something actually serious mm -hmm. so that's a, that, that, that's a that's a whole side conversation but um, if that this is an unfortunate situation, I mean, I mean, does it feel very heavy? I read this. Yeah. Whenever you get one, everyone else saw. Uh... Boy, this is my first time here, you know, so I'm not sure. Like even the fact that she was even 17, you remember, girls at that age, guys at that age too, are not even sure of who they are as yet, mm -hmm. and you've been with her for 10 years. Yeah, man. In, You're all she knows. Right. In all truth, she's not the same person she was at 17 as she is now. So yeah. if along the way, you know. What? She decides to say, boy, I know this to me. I feel a way so she never be like, truthful to you and say, hey, you know, I no longer want to continue this relationship. But I will apologize, you know, on behalf of Simone and all Simone. other women. We are truly sorry for hurting you, my boss. Pick up yourself. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Respect. Ah. <laughs> Met her at 100. A sharp brown tickers from up, up town. We conversed to move through the dating stage, then started our relationship. So we decided to get tested for STIs as we promised each other exclusivity. Which is fair. Mom's forged. Kiss me, Rascla. Me have to do this candle. Forged negative STI results. She worked at UA and now I'm stuck with HIV. By the time I found out, we broke. We had broken up and she migrated. Monique, you're wicked. I don't know what to say. And why you not declare your status? That's so. And that's what I'm saying then, Monique. And then why aren't you sleeping with him, protecting Monique, knowing goddamn well? And why aren't you on medication? Because there are medications for that money. Why are you doing that? Yeah, to make you like undetectable so and like money untransferable. Now, Jesus, me now ask you, God, now nah, welcome you to the pearly gates. No matter what you do, girl. No, man, money. Get off the fast and three years Monique. why would and as a medical professional like this is not something You're that you so should dishonest. be doing you know like you know you shouldn't be withholding your status and forging statuses you know your results like, Monique, you that is so this you are such an awful no money if you do that to somebody knowingly like you know some other nana can sign God. Some man on a conscience, that's all. I don't want to sleep at night. This is really wicked for sure. When it's a money, can wicked. Money do so many stuff, this a Perry. Sleeping with somebody unprotected, sleeping with somebody without declaring status, forging their your, 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 your guess, results. Your results. Yeah. Running off without even <laughs> saying anything. No woman never run off. She migrated. She ran off. That's probably the only legal thing she did. So. <laughs> <laughs> Everything is illegal. She run off, Perry. Money can't forget lock up money. No, money. That's why we keep it ski and done because of people like short bro tickers money from up top. <laughs> <laughs> My God, money. God, no, hey. you're, you're really rude, though, money. God, that's no. why you have to 
afraid of people for chewing up every kind of know who is who and what is what you know that's why I'm not sleepy sleepy my love yeah, yeah. Tell you from one bed my have another oh. summer sleep any other bed a hotel bed wrap it up <laughs> no matter how them tell you say them not of this and them not of that and you want to get tested wrap it up cause you don't sure especially in the name of L-O-V-E do, no, do, no, 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 do, no, 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 people own their worst than money, More do, they really oh outside that money, them something they have to declare, that's why them to always put on a little plastic, because the people have discuss, have an honest this have conversation about exclusivity, exactly. and then go to the little test together and say, yeah man, I weed this now, pure backers money in the pan, pure backers, pure backers, no one's there at all sick. Money can't go inside the door. Money no dip on no medication, Perry. Money probably a live in a all denial, so she's not gonna take no meds. Cause she said, oh, me, me not that. Me <laughs> not that, and lie when I tell me. She's still in the middle of the summer, man, this is a false positive. Short broad money from up to me not that, Perry. Short broad tickers. Tickers like a me. Can't let have them stuff in there. Bad to bad, guys. That was wrong on so many levels, money. I'm not gonna lie, I forgot down for that. Money got God. I said I gotta wait for B to you see you No, really, I should be with a big bright board Got no money, you forgot that money Alright now my side, see me here now, the last one <clears throat> In the name of Jesus Hallelujah I dated my Jesus father, what is no I dated my girl for 8 years She moved in even though I didn't ask <laughs> against him and other friends I had. She got pregnant, had twins, one died at birth, I was traumatized. Four, four years later, I had a DNA and the child wasn't mine. I lost a really great prospective relationship due to her. There was nothing prospective about this egalitator from birth. God no, from another high school she ate it. No, uh, him, him meet somebody else. Him lose another one like he could have one another nice girl in there and him lose that one because him there with three. And that him mean Perry. Come the man, you want sugar? You bring a star one. I lost a really great prospective relationship. Due to her, her, yes. Oh, and all this time she knew the child wasn't mine. She's still in my house. Twelve years of slave. Well I know. Well I know. She's still in my house because of my mother. The parents are doing God knows. But I'm now married to a great woman who understands me. Well, I'm so weird. Even come out so of the room. Well, I'm so Well, I'm so Well, I'm so Who understands me. We are expecting our first child together also. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm so trying to understand. Yeah, so me, I'm a wife. I'm an ex. Then I move on. And a child. Then the mother of? Yes. With my ex-girl. Yes. Who gave me the jacket? Who I was with for 12 years? I walk with every baggage I have ever claimed in this life. Check on. I do not carry anything. Everything is with me. 50 pounds. Everything. It's over weird. You done? You finished? Read back your last line, you sure? Yeah. What say? He said she's still in my house because of my mother, but I'm now married to a great woman who understands me. No woman in a great. We are expecting our first child together also. I never got married in another time, um, messed it. She probably thought that he was broken from the situation though, Tana, and I thought that is very traumatic. And then why am I getting with you and marrying you? Then Perry, if you, I think because you're Because woman feel like she can't save man. Oh, that's true, because we're bobbits. Yeah, man, and the, and the, and the child that will bring it together. And a regular will build building for sure. We'll build yeah, man, cement so block everything. Yeah, well, that's true. Pure yeah. man child will build a pure man child. Yeah, man, with a pool and a view. Oh. Yeah. But I just want some clarity there though, but I just want to know if you, your wife, and your, your unborn child is in the house with your ex oh, and one sorry, of your sir. twins a plus your and mother. A, four and a half, five and a half because the mother, I forget she lived the five and a half for really Oh, you forget that the mother lived there, the mother. I am so sorry. And I, look in, and, I look in, and I look in the mother tell the girl for moving, you know. Yes, and I look in the mother tell the little girl for moving her things them. I don't know, some of the parents, I oh, don't know, they just want to. Yeah, because him said him didn't ask. So look more, she's chest here now. 
five and a half people. So if you put two and two together, two and two make four, and four is the mother. Four are the mother. And then five and a half are we living in the house. Yeah, man, four are the mother, because the mother put the mother together and tell the girl for coming to the house. So make sure not tell her for come out, then I go, she give me jacket and then something. And either we are either either we is our first grandchild, Tanya. But it's not his. She, she done, she done, she done oh, tell so the she, people them. She so can't she, take it back. So she clear the girl as our daughter. She then. call her sister them. She call her mother. She call her friends them. She have a grandchild. Oh, we can't she call can't. back and say. And I'm my grandchild. Betty, yeah, man. you know what say? No. The one who are in Monique. Yeah. Yeah, man. All five and a half of us will just live here and then the baby's gonna come and it's gonna be six. Yeah. And then the mom decides to have a boyfriend. It's seven of us. Hi. Yeah, man. One big happy family. Mm. Yeah man, sprinkle sprinkle. <laughs> <laughs> Got it, okay. My today my Jesus, I'm real last one you guys. Hold on the next second. She used my credit card and tell me I should check up on a girl's trip only to find out she and man locked down a hotel. Okay. Which is right. Yeah man, she ain't got that. <laughs> block my personal number. I never block my business number. I miss it, she and man a kiss up, kiss up pa. With caption when Bay treats you to a vacation. What's <laughs> a true one in my life, she tell? But a Bay treat her. So let me care, love. Ah! Mighty God! Hey, girl, you're angry. A Bay treat her, Perry. Hey, girl, you're angry, your caption. <laughs> I wish you could drink pina colada. Mighty that the girl blocking personal now, but not in business. When like so when him check the WhatsApp status now, you know, when him check the WhatsApp it's status, him get the shock on life. I want the bank call him now and say, um, Mr. Rogers. Are you by excellence oyster bay? Just confirming. <laughs> Mighty Jesus, Anika, you're angry than Anika. Anika said when Bay treats you to a bitch. Tell the truth, a Bay treats her. Just Mighty like that Jesus, one. the girl should have had a little extra panties and a little tops for steal wow. the deal. So, emoji? No. When Bay treats you to a vacation with Bay. <laughs> no, she don't want to be wearing a method. <laughs> hey, Anika, you have the recipe, girl. You have the recipe, you're angry that. Yeah, I'm good at it. Yeah, I'm good at it. It's like going to the man credit card money intro, but then I get to actually do the service. The bank never cares saying that you swipe it or not. Oh my god. <laughs> no, but you can't report it cards to a lane. Yeah, but either way, uh, the service done though. The service done though. Oh, she though. get through with what she get through. She get through. Yeah, and, and the first one you can do it. Yeah, man, she get through what she get through. She not, she not, she not respond to them after that. She, when they. Treats it to one person. Man, the man's amount of bereaved. We're not afraid of God. And that me I say, I'm not afraid of people and neither. The police. We're not afraid of people and police and jail cell and sleep on concrete and eat bread back at tin oh food. Oh my god. We're not afraid of them some of their pure jail cell and dark and dark light and and, and ring cell. Star and what are your family I get called a foreigner? Mm. Did you see? No man. Anika in the paper. No man. We're not. We're not. Cause he a man. No man. We're not afraid of on a fraud. On a fraud. We're not afraid. <laughs> What a fraud. What a uh, fraud. What a 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 God no, if only we didn't have that kind of art then. Mighty name of Jesus. Get it on, give me a credit card. No, I mean, I mean God would take and make example out of it. I'm not doing it, I'm crazy. Me go and work hard and take my, my money by me one by me. Come girl, give me a credit card. I'm going say when friend takes you uh, on a vacation. Uh, 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 uh. Why? I don't know I'm going to store them though. I feel like I read a show. I don't know if you care. I don't know if you 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 Hell, oh, Mrs. England, Mrs. England and the name of Jacket. Oh my God, I'm not lying. I'm looking at some book door. 
New York Times bestseller. I'm not reporting the life. I'm not wasting the story then. I send them to Point Perry and tell them. I'm not going to idiot. This is not going to laugh. This is not going to idiot. My name is Jesus. And then the idiot in the car, I'm not going to afraid for fraud. I'm not afraid for fraud, but I'm not afraid to make something out of it. My name is Jesus. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. I'm going to reach out to you. I'm going to I hope you enjoyed the video. I'm going to reach out to you. I'm going to shock. I hope you enjoyed this week's. What was your favorite story? To be honest with you, Perry, I hated all of them. <laughs> they, were, they all made my stomach turn. Two of them did every video, but we're going to exit them. And the rest of them, we're not like, only forget to laugh off. I'm not really outside the door. I'm not really outside the door. God, no, pure jacket and pure clothes. What well, on some seamstress to do? Pure jacket and none of them. I don't have no clothes for no back. I don't have a jacket in the fit. What on some seamstress? Oh my God, I don't have really would I want to be baby and stuff, you know? Why the world really not ever fit true? Sorry for Dr. M. Do you know what about Dr. M again? Um, 17 year old girl. Oh, um, yeah, because yeah, he really invests a lot. But you know, sometimes yeah, lessons learned. Yeah, yeah, and the door not going to you know, get a better window for you. Yeah, man. And that's a terrible door. And Dr. M gave me a big, um, like, give me a big chopped in man. So I can scale one and jump through the window. I might get through the life. <laughs> it was fun, guys. I hope you enjoyed this week's video. <laughs> Don't forget to comment, like, share, and subscribe. Follow me on all socials at White Perry. And follow her on all socials at Tananya. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. Bye.